Hey there, so how long after repotting should we start fertilizing orchids? Well, with a few exceptions, I like to start to fertilize about a month after repotting. The reason for that is that in about a month there will be some roots just taking off, starting to grow, starting to really absorb water and nutrients. Before that, the roots might still take their time to adjust to the new setup, time in which the nutrients will just pile up, build up, or just get flush away, being wasted and not utilized. Also, the orchids do have reserves of nutrients. So even if in that first month it will need nutrients, it will get them from the reserves. You don't need to fertilize. And it's more important to avoid buildup than trying to fertilize an orchid which is not growing fast anyway. Obviously, the roots can start to take off a little sooner or even a little later. So the rule of thumb is when you see the roots actively growing like this, you know the orchid is in rapid active growth and it's going to absorb nutrients. And generally that happens after the first month. But of course, each orchid will be just a little different. If you're dealing with a rather sickly orchid that you see didn't start to take off after a month, you shouldn't necessarily start to fertilize at least full strength after exactly one month. You kind of need to always look at your orchid and see what it's telling you. And obviously, if you're dealing with an orchid which is going through dormancy, you shouldn't really start to fertilize until this orchid is really actively growing. Like capsidums, you can repot them in the dead of winter when there's no growth in sight. Obviously, do not fertilize them then, don't water them, and so on and so forth. When active growth is happening, that's when plants need fertilizer the most. Now, it's true that when we offer slow-release fertilizer, some of that fertilizer will not be utilized in the first month. Yeah, it's not an exact science. Just make sure you're not overdoing it. At some point, the orchid will utilize that slow release, but in the first month or so, maybe in the first two weeks, it will just not, and that's okay. Again, just don't go with water-soluble fertilizer on top of that slow release fertilizer in the pot. So as always, the best thing to do is to let the orchid tell you what it's doing. Just observe it. If you're not entirely sure what your orchid is doing, you can start to fertilize half strength after the first month. If you're still having doubts, wait two months. It's absolutely fine. The reserves will last you for a year, to be honest. So if you want, you can skip fertilizer for a year, but I would not recommend it because deficiencies start to pile up. But yeah, better to delay fertilizer after repot than to start too early. And I hope that clears up the question. Thanks for watching. Bye!